Hey guys, I'm back in the last part on Lock Boo's level 11 weapon, the Maelstrom. And now we're gonna go on Lock Wanyu's level 11 weapon, which had a total of 22 votes. So, just like any other level 11 weapon, we have to go to Legend Mode. And since we are going for Guan Yu's, we have to go to his Legend Stage. And I'll show off the six small, like always. Alright, here we go. So, we already know the narration and the special rules, so move on. We know the objectives, we know the unit info, the equipment, the weapon, as you know, we had the Blue Moon Dragon at level 10. I can't equip any items, however, I am allowed bodyguards, so I will have all eight bodyguards, and I'll set the weapon to Pike, and that pretty much covers it, so let's do it. Alright, so in order to obtain the S rank and unlock Wanyu's level 11 weapon, you have to do the following. You have to get 300 KOs, and you have to defeat Eugene, Yui Jean, and Lee Dien. You also have to do this while defending the carriage. There is a specific dialogue where you cannot trigger three time, times. Excuse me. And that dialogue is, the carriage is in danger, you must protect it. If you allow that dialogue to pop up three times, then you're going to have to go for the weapon over again because there will be no way for you to really obtain it due to the amount of points you lose in the process. So, what I'm going to do is rack up the KOs, rack them up quickly, and uh, wait for Eugene to pop up, who will appear from the south. Alright, so far so good. Since there's nobody coming from the west, I'm going to actually hit the gong and uh, prevent anyone from coming in from this direction. That was not supposed to happen. I think the hardest part for the, me is going through this entire stage without any items. Because uh, a power rune would be nice. Me getting pushed into the attack times 2 isn't great. That's something I was hoping wouldn't happen. Because there's usually a battle axe somewhere. And um, unfortunately I let it come through. So now I might have to let... Oh, I'm gonna have to do this the harder way. Unless there's another battle axe nearby. And hooray for random uh, teleporting troops. Time to go. Alright, Eugene appeared. I'm going to continue on with the attacking because I want to see if I can get one more battle axe. Usually a battle axe do, battle axes pop up over in these sections here. So and getting health is always a good thing. All right. There it is.
Now I'm going to go for it. Hopefully my bodyguards can uh, take the damage. Are you fucking kidding me? Really? Alright, well. He's down. Now it's just me closing these two gates. Oh shit. Alright, let me get my bodyguards over here. I totally forgot that that gate was still shut. Alright. There's the carriage right there. Now, let's go for it. So far, so good. Oh, shit. The carriage started the move. All right. So now here's the tricky part. Defeating Yui Jean and Li Dien. Uh, before they both retreat. And that will lead to a new problem. Breaking a fucking pot. The one pot that didn't have anything. Yeah. Alright. So I would want to have this gate open and then the one gate up in the north shut. But that unfortunately involves a bit of luck. And uh, I wish you the best of luck, no pun intended, with that. Really? Alright, got a hundred. Now I just gotta wait for uh, Yui Jean to appear. In the meantime, I'll rack up more KOs. There should be a battle axe and speed shoes over here as well. So if I were you, make sure you uh hang on to at least one or both. If you can, definitely both. Please tell me that it contains that. Oh my God! Am I defeating the wrong pe uh, wrong troops? It 
You know what? Let's just go for it. Really? Hopefully that finishes him off. No, it's definitely not. And of course, Lee Dian pops up after I defeat. Well, there's only one good thing about this, and that is, you know what? I'm gonna shut up. Okay, yeah, I was going to say the one good thing about it is the gate hasn't, uh, the north gate hasn't opened yet. I'm not saying that's a bad thing, but still, now it's open, but at least it's opened and I'm ready. But, uh, I definitely need to make sure I go for Lee Dien now, because... When Zhou Song appears, he will retreat, or try to retreat, and I can't afford him to retreat while he's on horseback. Oops. 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 Did he really just block it up like a fucking fortress? Yeah, this is gonna lead to another problem. That's what happens when you try to jump attack me. I'll just buy time for now. Because if Zhou Song does appear, he won't attack me at all. Which is not a bad thing, but I still have to chase him. And now he will withdraw, which will give me the opportunity to attack him when he won't attack me. Alright, time to run. Now I'm gonna go. Please tell me I have. Okay. I have some bodyguards left. So that's fine. But I still need to hit the last remaining gong. Alright. And there we go. Now, the gate, uh, the carriage will start to move once again. Let's make sure we catch up to it. Or get stopped by, uh, troops. Either or. Oh, wait. Yeah, let me set my bodyguards to attack and not stall. Alright, 
here's the hard part, going through the rest of the stage. Where are my bodyguards? So far so good. I mean not so far so good, but we're almost done with the stage. Yeah, you know it's bad when a fucking private blocks up. Alright, got 200 KOs. on its way over there abandon the castle we will escape from the north yeah it seemed like the carriage started to move without me you might want to be careful with that or get pushed against or away from the carriage So, if you failed to defeat the DN specifically, this is where you would have to be careful. And why the fuck is the carriage going in different directions? I mean, granted, it's going to help me out with the KOs to a degree, but it's only to a degree. Please tell me that's health and I'm not getting pushed away from it. Yeah, the carriage is still moving. An ambush will appear right over here after it crosses the bridge and lead the end will also appear there. Um, I would highly recommend you staying nearby but don't get too close to Zhang Liao if you don't have the KOs. For me, I don't have the KOs. For some reason, you might be able to get it like that. Um, never mind. We're good. Uh, I said 300. That's something I was going to tell you. You could possibly get the weapon and uh, have 200 KOs. As for me, as you see, I have 221. I don't think it will lead to a perfect score. But nonetheless, and then once it crosses the gate. Zhang Liao will appear, and we're set. Lord Guan Yu, this is no time to be stubborn. I, Zhang Liao, will guarantee the lady is protected. Resisting further would only endanger our lady. Very well, Zhang Liao, until I find my brother. I shall yield to the banner of the Han. And that's a win. Alright, so now here's the real test. I did say if you allow that dialogue to appear three times, you won't get the weapon. However, this happened after I t obtained the weapon. So I still get the S rank because something I was going to bring up during the stage, but it was just so fucking intense. Um, I've tried going for this numerous times. Um, 
and I made it to the end. Sometimes I obtained it, sometimes I didn't. Uh, well, the one time that I wanted to see it was actually possible, I actually got the KO count around 240, 250, and uh, I ended up getting the weapon anyways. Uh, I tried it again recording, and I didn't, and I only had around 220 KOs, just like you see here. But the weapon didn't pop up. However, I got 220 something KOs and the weapon popped up. I don't think I got the perfect 100, but that's also another thing. Will it count after I obtain the weapon? We'll see. Anyways, a KO count is 231, a worthy opponent count is 3. Our clear time is 17 minutes and 40 seconds, which is a grand total of 5,496 points altogether. So. The points are on at max, so I could always press X, but I'm not going to. Because now I, I'm really nervous. I want to see if this is actually a thing where you could fuck up on failing, quote unquote, triggering the uh, dialogue and still obtain the weapon. Apparently so. Alright, well, this is a first for me. So. And it's something I was actually expecting. I didn't think it was actually going to happen with me, personally. So, once you obtain the weapon, you can allow the dialogue to occur. Uh, oh, you could really allow the dialogue to appear, uh, trigger. Um, it was just more speculation, but I didn't really think it was actually a thing. Anyways, here's the level 11 weapon. Uh, why I still get the S rank, though? That's the thing. You know what? I'm not going to even worry about that. And uh, just like any other level 11 weapon, it has attack power plus 60. And it gives you the Peacock Urn, which gives you additional health at level 17. The Speed Squirrel, obviously, extra speed, level 17. Longsbow, uh, bow attack, level 13. And the Horn Helm, which is mounted attack at level 20. So, that's how you get it. And... In order to guarantee to get the level 11 weapon, we have to have 300 KOs and defeat Eugene, Yui Jean, and Li Tian. Um, I'm at a loss for words for the fact that I only got 220 something KOs and still got it. I, It's probably for the fact that I, if I had to take a guess, it's probably for the fact that I never triggered that dialogue at all. I could be wrong though. Please correct me if I'm wrong, <laughs> because uh, these uh, level 11 weapons are a bit uh, finicky to obtain, because it all revolves around the points. Uh, let me stop with the rambling and figure out the points. Well, bodyguards first. So there we go. The grade. Okay, we got an S. So I'm pretty sure it's the KOs for the fact that I didn't allow that dialogue to pop up pretty much makes it a sure thing but um I just want to say 300 KOs just to play it safe um I wish you the best of luck for this weapon because it was a very tricky weapon for me to get that's just me though um I'm not the best player in the world I will never claim that I am but um it was very 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 difficult for me and this is only the third level 11 weapon. <laughs> Anyways, full save. And there you have it. You've been watching my gaming adventures featuring Dynasty Warriors 4. In some cases, Extreme Legends. Well, in this case, it really is Extreme Legends. And I'll see you in the next part. Where we'll go unlock another level 11 weapon. And I believe the next one will be Leo Base. I mean, I already posted the, uh, the list in order. I'm pretty sure it's Liu Bei's. I just want to make sure. Yep. Liu Bei's is next. Alright. So, peace out.